it's Sonya Miller of Junk Monkey Pinkaby. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are making use of all the good junk that I got. Oh my gosh, I'm smiling from ear to ear. I can't stop smiling because I just love some good junk, okay? Who remembers when I found this on my Junkin haul? It just feels so vintagey and I love all like the retro colors, the muted colors that are into it. I'm going to repurpose it today into a plant holder. Yeah! On my way into work today, I stopped at a uh, far a roadside flower stand. Hey, how are ya? Hi, I'm Heidi. Oh, hey Heidi. I'm gonna go say hello to Heidi. I'll be right back. Well, guess what guys? Heidi is a good sport. So Heidi just came in. Where'd you come from? Erie, Pennsylvania. So a couple hours away. How long did it take you to get here? Almost three. Almost three hours, okay. So she came in today. She watches the vlog just like you guys. So now you can say hello to yourself, your future self. <laughs> so you brought something for me? Just for you. <gasps> Look at this guys, so pretty. Okay, so I just started this vlog saying that I have this tin and I'm gonna like repurpose it into a planter today. And uh, I'm looking at this. Wouldn't this make a cool planter too? It would. Right, we can put some holes in the bottom of it. That way it never has to go away. We can keep it and repurpose it. Maybe so. I made those for you. She made me some earrings, guys. Isn't this beautiful? Oh my gosh. And I love this color. This reminds I love me of mermaid tail. So uh, those are for you to play with. Did you make these? I did. Was that so thank you Heidi for coming to visit me today I appreciate your visit and thank you again for your trinkets of love I think I'm definitely going to repurpose that can so you stay tuned for that so today we are onward and upward with repurposing this can right here I love it I'm gonna take it outside and I think I'm gonna get Matt's help because I'm gonna need some holes okay one thing I did learn is that you know what flowers need drainage so we're just gonna go ahead and we're gonna grab a screwdriver and a hammer and with Matt's help, we're gonna go, we're gonna take the camera to the back of the shop here and we'll find a nice place so we can uh, do the rest of our work outside. How many holes do you think we should put in here? About three or four, maybe five or six. All right, let's do it. Love it, love it, love it. So if you have somebody to help you, that's always a great thing. They say, you know, that when you play with dirt, that it's supposed to be good for you, like building um, immunity and that sort of stuff for yourself, but also it's great to play with because it's mother nature and it just feels good. So look at this, I got a bag of dirt. You talk about me being a repurposer, you know, I needed some dirt to, to haul out here to my shop because I can't dig up any dirt up out here. So I took some dirt from my house and I brought it out with me today in this bag. If Pandora only knew how I repurposed this bag, right? What's mom getting for the next gift? Oh, she's getting a bag of dirt. Put some pieces of rocks and things down for drainage. Perfect, and now we go ahead and we put the dirt out, at least just a little bit of it. This is the plant that I picked. It's funny because the lady at the flower stand this morning, she's like, now you're not gonna wanna water these too much. Okay. So, a low maintenance plant. We love that for us. Massage his roots, because everybody loves a good massage. And I think he's gonna be the perfect size for this can. Oh my gosh, I love him already. And yes, he's a boy apparently. Isn't it funny how we like call things guys and girls? All right, let's put a little bit more dirt over here. I think this is gonna be a really nice one for my, like my kitchen window seal. Now I think I'm just gonna go ahead and find a, um, like a bottom for this. And I'm pretty sure I have an old terracotta um, pot bottom kicking around because the pot got broken. So I'll use that for the base. And guys, instantaneously, we have a gorgeous succulent, just repurposed can. I just think the vibe of this is beautiful. Do you guys love it? Let me know below in the comments. Will you do this as well? And now, of course, I've just gotta go and put a little bit of water on there so that he can acclimate real nice. I love how it turned out. This was just a quick project and some days you just want to get creative but you don't want to do a whole lot. 
where you just kind of want to change it up a little bit. So it was so fun to get my fingers in some dirt today. Thank you for tuning into my channel. Thank you for subscribing to my channel. Give me a big thumbs up and leave me a comment below. Will you keep your eyes open the next time you're out junking and picking for some awesome cans so you can do this too. See you guys tomorrow. Much love. Bye.